Hello and what is going on today guys, Tomcat here and today we are back in Spin Tires Mud Runner uh, with my friend Biz Rebellion and we're going to be we're going to be doing some uh, some exploring on the island map. Uh, first thing we're going to be doing is doing some recon uh, then after that we're going to do some logging and uh, we're just going to see how it goes. I mean it's my first time actually properly playing multiplayer in this game and it's also kind of his first time too. So we're going to do a multiplayer let's play and uh, we're going to see how it goes on this map and if you guys enjoy it then uh, then maybe we can bring you guys some more. So and I do apologize for my voice being a little scratchy at the moment. I'm not sure actually why it is probably because I recorded a lot earlier today but uh, but that's all good. That's all good. We'll go ahead and I'm going to go ahead and get in the UAZ personally but uh, just because it's a little bit better of a recon vehicle and, um, and then he can he can run whatever he wants. I'm not going to tell him what to run, and he can run whatever he wants. So I'm just going to run the UAZ because it's a little bit more, uh, it's a little bit more maneuverable, and it's a, definitely a lot smaller than some of the other trucks. If I can, oh, I need my parking brake. <laughs> sorry, sorry about the toot toot there. <laughs> Say what? Sorry about the horn there. Oh, you're uh, good, man. You're good. Uh, I'm thinking I want to take this path over here to the right, because if we take that, we can stay along the edge of the edge of the water, go over the river, and then unlock this watch point by the lumber mill. Uh, or, well, one of the lumber mills. So. Yeah, yeah. Sounds good. I'm going to go over here. The right. And so I do. Oh, go ahead. If you're heading that way to the lumber mill, should I maybe head towards the garage at the top? If you want to head to the garage, I would say, you know what then? If you're going to head that way, then I'll go with you so I can scout ahead and then get rid of the watch point up there so we know exactly where to take the big truck. Because you're going to need to, you're going to need to tow a garage trailer up there. Yes. And I, it, it's... It's always easier if you can tow a trailer up and have a scout and not get stuck. Okay. Sounds and, good. And plus, if you do get stuck, I'm there with a winch to pull you out. Yes, exactly. Um, trailer hitch. Ah, that's what it's called. I was looking for the... It, it wasn't called a trailer hitch before, see, was it? Uh, yeah, it was... Well, it was called... It, Actually, I don't remember what it was called. It was called something else, but it wasn't called, like, just a normal trailer hitch, I don't think. Right, straight ahead. I gotta get used to these controls, because they're so different to the first one. They're a little... I mean, are you playing on keyboard? No, I'm using the uh, the Xbox controller. Okay, because I, I sometimes use keyboard, and I sometimes use my 360 controller. Like, it just depends, because... I could use an Xbox One controller, but I, wow, my voice just went crazy. Um, <laughs> I could use an Xbox One controller, but I kind of actually prefer to use a 360 controller. I just kind of like the way it feels in my hands a little bit better. Yeah, yeah. Let me see. Okay. I'm thinking the uh, best way to go here is going to be left. And plus, if you go, oh, jeez. Also, a uh, just, that's the that's the thing is I don't know how much you played the game, but um, a definitely something to keep in mind if you are having trouble with wheel spin, um, stick it in like low range two, um, and that will usually be a low enough gear to get you out of whatever you need. I think I may be one step ahead of you there, bro. I'm actually in low two right now. <laughs> perfect, 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 perfect. Because I've been leaving it and actually been leaving it in an auto, <laughs> but. <laughs> um, not all the time, but like, especially in the UAZ, you can just kind of leave it in auto and drive it around. Yes. I just love that little thing. I mean, it's just so light. I need to unlock the blue one. Oh, I know. I was, I was actually doing the challenge where you got to drive it up a hill in first person. Okay, in did you actually do that in first person? I did. Because if you did that in first person, that is so hardcore, it's ridiculous. It, it took me maybe 10 attempts, but I did do it. That's <laughs> awesome. Like, that is that that is insane. I'm not entirely sure how the video turned out, but it's going to turn out some shape. It's going to turn out somehow, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I mean, 
I was concerned that that gate, I was, I, I realized, I was like, I was like, I was concerned for a second it wasn't going to let you through because you had a trailer, and then I was like, wait a minute, that's only for lumber. Only for lumber. And that's what it is. Whoa. Oh, sorry, sorry. about that. Kind of made you give your brakes a workout. <laughs> <laughs> and let's go, we're going to go left. Okay, cool. Yeah, kind of made you give your brakes a workout on that one. I'm sorry about that. It's okay. I should have been concentrating on the on the road. <laughs> ah, you're you're good. I stopped in the middle of the road, so I think it was like kind of on both of us on that one. But the watch point is a little bit further ahead of the garage, so I'm thinking like the garage really should be on this main road. So as long as it is, you should be fine to get to it. And then shortly after you get to it, I'll unlock the garage. Or I mean, I've got it in high right now, so I might be able to just get up there. Um, ahead of time. Dude, if you need to go on ahead of it, uh, go on ahead and grab it, you do it. Oh, dude, the garage is, like, right here. It's super easy. Oh, wow. That was a lot closer than I thought. It's, it, I don't know how it's actually this close. Like, literally all you gotta do is drive over that next hill, and you're good. You're done. Like, you're there. Yeah, I see it. So, let's see. I think if I go... I think if I go right here, um, yeah, I think if I go right here, I should be able to find the watch point that I need to find. If you watch all of the little, in, like, little intricate details with the water, like, it's so crazy because the first game didn't have anything close to that. I was, li literally, I was just about to say to you how much of a fantastic job they've done on those tiny little things. Well, like, if your exhaust is under the water, for example, you get bubbles. Like, where else do you get that? Yeah, I know. And I also noticed, um, oil, I think. You can the see what? The oil, flo oil floating on the top, like the shimmering. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It's insane. They have done a great job on this. Let me see. I think I'm going... I think I'm going the right way. Well, sort of the right way. Okay, yeah, got the island settler achievement there. Yeah, you're good. Oh, I found the watch point. I'm just gonna get out here and go ahead and grab it. Then we'll have we'll have access to a lot more of the map, and we can start with our deliveries, because yes. I can get a logging truck too. Oh, there's a log station right next to the garage here. It's super convenient. It's super oh, convenient. Yeah. All right. Go ahead, and go ahead and recover, and let me see. Actually, well, I'm going to go ahead and run back and grab... Well, I mean, I can switch. Here, I'm going to switch to a... Where's the B-131? It's back there. C-255. The C-255, that is what you're in, so if I switch to the B, I wonder if it can do a, oh yeah, okay, log carriage, log carrier, okay, perfect, log carrier, medium log cart, the only reason why I really want to use this one is because I haven't used it quite as much, um, I've used the other one a bunch, but I haven't used this one as much, so mm -hmm. I'm gonna just run this truck down to that other garage, and I'll meet you at the other lumber area, okay, dude, but let's, Actually, I do need to make sure real quick. Oh boy. No, that's not what I want. Okay, never mind. Never mind. Okay, we're good. I uh, I was freaking out for a second. I thought I uh, I thought my um, I thought my sound level was off. <laughs> I uh, I'm taking a risk here. I have the long log cart. The long cart. Wait, you can get the uh. You can use that on the on the the B class truck. Yes, I have it folded up on the back right now. Or the C-255. Oh, hold on. I think I'm in the C, and aren't I? Yeah, the C-255, sorry. Okay, long log... Oh! Okay, uh, let's see. Because I'll go ahead and run one of those two, because we've got... We've got two... Actually, no, you know what? If you're going to run the long cart, then I will run, because it's... Because it's what? Yeah, it's eight points. So if you run the long cart and I run a, um, just like a carriage, then we'll be able to get it done super quick. 
Yes, definitely. And I almost stole my engine. That's not good. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Actually, this is great, so I'll run down there straight away with the carriage. This is uh, kind of turning into a bit of a speed run here. <laughs> I was a little bit. I mean, I'm kind of, I don't know, it's weird because I've played spin tires for so many years. It's like, it. even though I'm still discovering new things in Mudrunner here and there, there are certain things where I'm like, where I'm like, yeah, do this. And then if the other guy's doing this, then I should grab this truck and we'll do that. And then we'll get to the objective. It's like, yes, I used to always just me and my friends would come on uh, like on the old game. And we were just like bust out objectives left and right and left and right. We beat like there was one night we beat like three maps in one night. Wow. <laughs> That's Just, dedication right there. Yeah, we went nuts, dude. Why why does it keep telling me to position my truck? I hate this. Yeah, the the positioning of the truck is finicky. That's that's one of those things that's literally always been finicky, no matter what yeah. spin tires game. Like ever since the original tech demo from like two, two and a half years ago, uh, to Mud Runner now. Trailer placement has always been like the most finicky thing. Oh yes. You just gotta make sure it's like as close to straight and level as possible, which I get is easier said than done a lot of the time. <laughs> it is, but it's okay, I got it. We You're good up. then. Now it's time for me to try not tip this thing. And see the other thing too is like you've got a pretty gnarly hill to climb to get out of there, so if you want, if you want, I can probably, like, I feel like since I'm only uh, running a carriage on this truck, I can probably help pull you out. Yeah, sounds good, dude. Because, uh... I mean, if you want to try and give it a go, you can, but uh, but you may roll over. <laughs> but knowing me, <laughs> Just I, maybe. Uh, Do what? I, knowing my luck, it's probably a guarantee that I'd roll over. <laughs> <laughs> eh... Don't worry about it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm having trouble even turning around in this thing. Jeez, yeah, what? that's that's the other thing is maneuverability kind of goes out the w Oh my god, I forgot how massive that was. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's see. Short logs. All right. All right. So I'm loaded up. I definitely have, see that's the thing with me, is like I definitely have maneuverability on my side, but... <laughs> yes. <laughs> so, our log... Come on, come on, come on. Let's see. Oh, I think I got it. Let's see, that's another log station. Oh, I know exactly which lumber mill we're going to. Easy. So, we're gonna go up there and we're gonna make a well or just go down along the bottom yeah 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 yeah. that that's the way we're gonna go no big deal okay I guess I just follow you say what I just follow you right yeah yeah you just follow me we're, we got this see I've already been to the location on this map once but I like the at least the first lumber drop-off location because we're gonna need a, another route uh, to the other one but the first one should be no problem. Okay, cool. I just need to finish my 7,000 point turn. See, that's the thing about that truck, dude. You're gonna have to, like, you're gonna be... You're gonna be fighting the length of that trailer the whole time. Yes. You know, it was funny because just before we got talking tonight, I was playing the first spin tires, and I was on coast? No, not coast, sorry. Uh, is it planes? Planes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, my I had a long log cart like this one, and I was just about out of fuel. So I got the 8x8, and I towed it from one end of the map all the way to the objective on the other. Holy Ooh. crap. It was intense, dude. That's insane. I've never, like, I don't know. I've never, like, run one truck out of fuel completely and then just tried to tow it all the way back with another one. That's, like, God, that's that's almost sketchy in a way. <laughs> oh, trust me, there was a few hairy moments where it was just about to tip over close to the end, and I was about to rage, but it, it got there. <laughs> <laughs> I've had a couple moments like that. Couple moments for sure. 
All right, let me see where we're gonna want to go. Uh, I want to go. Okay. Uh, we're going. We're just gonna cut straight across. Uh, through the um through the water right here. Sounds good. We're gonna cut straight across, and then we're gonna follow kind of like the edge of the beach. It'll look like we're going into a really sketchy area where the trailer's gonna roll over, but trust me, you'll be fine. I've been through here before. Okay. 